Hey guys, Wet Movie One back here again for another little out and about video, special event video uh, for you guys today. Right now, I'm in Hollywood, California, about to go to the It Chapter Two experience that they have going on. They just like decked out the streets, you know, with Pennywise posters and everything like that. Of course. They have the carnival going on on the other side of these walls. But I'm out here with a very special guest right now, my homeboy. Hey, everybody. Jose. We're gonna right. go. We're gonna go in there and experience this together. Yes, the horror buddies are gonna are back together to go uh, check out Pennywise's uh, little little carnival, or something. Carnival okay. slash okay. like Canal Days carnival. carnival horror maze thing that's yeah. going on. And of course, they have the red balloons decked out everywhere because you know. We're off float here, but we're gonna take you in there and show you guys the experience yep. And if you guys are in Hollywood, you guys can come over here for free. Yeah, free yeah. They even have a lot of people lined up ready to get in to get scared and to witness the town of Derry But in Hollywood It's been 27 years since their last encounter <laughs> Inside the fun house you're gonna find some of the most wonderful terrors and spooks like you've never seen before. Have fun. Stay safe. And go see the It Movie Chapter 2 coming out on September 6th. You guys want to play? Let's play. Follow me. Jose, you really want to follow that guy? Yeah, let's go play, man. Okay. We got the ring toss. We got the ring toss. We got the pop game. You can play until you win, until you won one ticket. And then once you won a ticket, you can go in and exchange it for a prize by spinning the prize wheel right over here. So guys, the next game we're going to play is us having to squirt inside of Pennywise's mouth. Hey. It's a dream come true. It is, huh? You always wanted to squirt into his mouth. I get it. Well, Jose won and he got a ticket so he gets to spin the wheel to see what prize he gets. Let's see. So let's see what you get, Jose. Yeah. Whoa! How cool is that? Oh, I love it. Look at this, guys. They even have a cool Ferris wheel here with Pennywise's face on it. I think it's just for show, but that is pretty cool. But we're about to go into the clown's mouth right now and witness the madness. Off we go! Whoa! You okay, George? Whoa! Bad things will happen to us, Jose, if we don't stay as a group. We hold hands. Okay. Whoa. Jose! Bro! I'm walking into. Ready? It's been nice knowing you. I don't know. You. It was nice. <laughs> oh no. Oh, but it's been nice knowing you. That's very Yeah, I know. I think we're getting in for a squeeze, Jose. Oh, oh bro! Oh, oh, God. Okay. oh shit! Now we're in the next room. I don't know what's in store for us over here, but they put us bleachers. They put us behind these gates. And I don't know what's beyond these gates right here. Oh! There. Gonna be here. Something's going on. I don't know what's happening. Whoa! 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 Whoa!
scary. Oh, hey, you're not that scary. Well, we just got out of the maze, Jose. We did. And they have this cool little like poster right here. I think it's the same poster that you got, you know, for winning the prize, like a different yep. color yep. or something. But it, it was a fun, it was a fun little experience. I mean, it's you know, it's a small space, but they really crammed in a lot. A lot of cool stuff I'm in there. Impressed. Yeah, and of course they have the red balloons the just everywhere over here but i'm sure if you guys are in hollywood you'll see it if you're driving you're driving around we just got out of the it chapter two maze we're in hollywood yeah so there is something we always have to do when we're in hollywood let's go hold up yeah boy we're at our next destination yes we and, are and if you can tell by this crazy little elevator that we're in how do you get to this thing yeah we're at amoeba records baby the first thing we see when we get into amoeba are these little postcards you can get for a dollar I don't know. Hmm. But let's head upstairs to where the DVDs and Blu-rays are. Check out this box that they have here of the Dolomite collection. It's like, dude, I, I think I have, I used to have this collection or may have this collection in my, in, at home right now from, you know, from way back in the day, but you saw the trailer for it, right? The new yes. one? Yes. Yeah. I'm With Eddie? Very excited for it. It was, it was written by the guys who did Ed Wood and yeah. their buddies of mine. I'm excited to see what they do. I, I'm, so, I'm so down to see it. And Eddie Murphy back in action. I'm excited. Like, I'm not going to lie, never been the biggest fan of those movies that there was some fun stuff right. about them not the biggest fan of them but seeing the trailer for the this new one just it's more exciting to see the making of yeah than the actual movies sometimes yeah so. exactly so yeah. i'm down like it would. yeah let us know are you down to see the new dolomite like this to get a candle with chucky on it <laughs> as jesus all hail and of course when i'm at amoeba i always have to check out the little adult print section that they have you know behind the little glass you know cabinet and they have some vhs's in here but this one's standing out to me right here, dude. Electric Boogaloo Breaking 2, or it's Breaking 2 Electric Boogaloo. The big box VHS. 50 bucks though. But that that, that is kind of cool. You ever you ever like those uh, break, breaking movies from back uh, in the day? The second one was always the best. Yeah. Uh, but then, of course, you get the ultimate collection was the $6 Never Ending Story 3. Oh, yeah, VHS, baby. I don't know baby. why that's there, but... That's, that's, that's the, all right. I think Jack, that's the, one of the first things i ever seen Jack Black in. I've never seen that, actually, I don't think. Yeah, it's all right. It's definitely not as cool as the other ones, but... I am sure. Jack Black is a bad... <laughs> I believe he, Jack Black's a bad guy in there. Oh, really? Yeah. But yeah, like I said, they have all these other, you know, candles in here of, like, you know, Cheech Marin and all these different other collectibles, like a, you know, Power Rangers lunchbox they have back there for, like, my homeboy Cody Blythe and things, all sorts of stuff, like little Beetlejuice like kind of figure over here they're actually trying to they're sort of kind of adding just new different things over here every time i come now like different little collectible pieces i think it's kind of kind of cool uh-oh uh-oh is that michael myers back there he followed us. all right guys i'm still over here at amoeba now with tom savini the master himself and what are you picking up over here at amoeba uh Le Mans. doesn't he just look like the actor from once upon a time in hollywood yeah that's super cool and i've never seen this one Oh, that's cool. So, is, is Amoeba it's like one of the places you come to to get your physical media? Absolutely. Yeah. Is that what you're all? Do you ever? Are you in, one of the one of the few places left? You know? No, I know. But are you a, more of a physical media guy, or do you ever go dive into the digital? Because I've never done that yet. Streaming, yeah, I look at streaming stuff. But I always, I like having stuff like this on the shelf. You know? Yeah, no, me too. I'm a physical media guy. But well, thank good you. Luck with the show, yeah. Thank you so much, Mr. Savini. You're the man. Thank you, sir. So I'm out of Amoeba right now. That was really kind of cool and random. You know, just running into Tom Savini, special effects, makeup artist, extraordinary. Air. but like dude one of my favorite uh, movies he's ever done was the remake of night of the living dead yes. that, that's the one that got me into the zombie movies to begin with i know it was george romero that started it and stuff but like that was the first one i ever seen yeah. that got me into the whole craze it wasn't the first one for me but it was the it was for me it's one of my favorite remakes ever made yeah it, it, it was it was just it was cool man because I, I hear stories about him sometimes at conventions but i never had a bad experience with no, him no he's a good dude, dude he, and he's into physical media man how cool was that the best well we had a fun little outing today, going to the It Chapter 2 experience. Yes. Coming over here to Amoeba, hanging out with Tom Savini for a couple of minutes. Yeah. Which I thought was cool, was talking about movies and physical media. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Let us know if you guys are excited to see the new It Chapter 2. If you guys are going to be coming out here to Hollywood to witness the experience. The carnival. Yeah. But uh, in the next video, you'll see, it's me at Dragon Fest as a guest. It'll be the second convention I've yes. ever, ever been to as You'll a guest. You'll be a panelist, yeah. The first one I was a guest at was your, your convention, the KitCon. That's right, good old KitCon. And uh, na day. yeah, na now it's Dragon Fest, so stay tuned for that video and let's see how that, that turns out. Thanks fingers for watching. Crossed. Yeah, fingers crossed. Give this video a thumbs up. We'll see you later. Cheers.